everyone. Aubrey here with Ida Bailey Technology Consulting. And today I'm going to show you how to use keyboard shortcuts in Salesforce Lightning Experience. First of all, if you press Control forward slash, it'll bring up a window that shows you all of the keyboard shortcut options that you have. Today I'm using a Windows computer, so it'll say Control. But if you're on a Mac, it'll be Command but the shortcuts will all be the same other than that. All right, let's get started. Probably the shortcut I use most often is the search bar shortcut. Just by pressing forward slash, your cursor will automatically move to the search bar, and you can search for accounts, contacts, or any other record really quickly. Now that we're at the sample account, we can edit it by pressing E, this pulls up the screen. We can update any information we need to. And instead of moving our mouse to click Save, we can also use Control S. It's a really common one that a lot of people know, but it's nice to know that Salesforce has that functionality as well. The next thing I'll show you is over to the side, we have this Activities area. We can edit an activity quickly by pressing the keys G and P on our keyboard simultaneously. If there are multiple activities, we can toggle between them using the arrow keys on our keyboard. So that's really nice and convenient. And we'll get out of that screen really quick. The last really simple one that I'll show you is if we like we're going to edit something or pull up any other window or select an item and decide that we no longer need to, escape will close or deselect whatever we were just on. And that's how you use keyboard shortcuts. Again, to view the whole list of them, control forward slash will bring up that screen. As always, if you have any questions, our team is here to help click the link below to get in touch. Thanks.